This is the A5 Wagyu burger from One Michelin Star Temporis. Now what I want to do in this video is I want to compare it to two of my favorite burger places. A uh, much lesser cost. I just want to see, you know, I mean, of course, I think this is going to be better. I didn't try it yet, but because it's higher quality beef and a bun here too. So this is uh, $25 and let's just go right in. Mmm. Mmm. You know what? I forgot to add these. But man, look at this. What is that sauce? It's truffle? It's like very earthy. Yeah. Wow, it is really earthy. But let's put these together. Holy crap. Now, this, right? I'll tell you this right now. My favorite burger so far. Uh, compared to the other two I had, Smith, I mean uh, Loyalist, and uh, Momotoro. Is, uh, yeah, Momotoro. But you know what? I think I'm doing this wrong here. Let's put, let's put tomatoes on here. Let's not overdo it. All right, here we go. Let's take this nice bite. Mmm. Now, is there napkins? I hope they give me napkins, no? All right. So I gotta be careful. But, oh, that smell. Mm. What is that sauce? It's like truffle oil or something like that. But before I try the next one, let me, uh, clean my taste but I don't want any like uh, the previous burger to sabotage the next one you get those flavor that just straggles on your taste bud so my favorite place is Hala Burgers now Hala Burgers is here in Rogers Park and what I like about it is take out I never had it dine in well you don't really dine in so takeout and it is really juicy even if it's takeout you know that's why that's the one thing I like about it so I want to compare but hold on a second let me get a napkin all right I'm back um okay see see this is dive right in mm -hmm. oh my god Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> now, it's falling all over the place. Now, this one, I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. The meat's not as juicy as before. And this one I got last, so it was the most freshest. Let me give it one more try. Now the the bun pulls pulls away from you for a little bit. As you bite into it, the bun pulls away. It's like really, you know, tough. See, but man, but I like this one. This is probably a burger that. Um, the great Khaleesi, Stormborn, or Mother of Dragon would eat, or what you would serve to. Mm. But to compare the price, it is five, six dollars versus twenty-five dollars. Now I'm very disappointed with Hala Burger. Well, hala, now hala means it is, I guess, in the more civilized way of dispatching the beef. But in the end, you know, it does, in the end, the animal becomes your dinner anyway. But maybe, you know, maybe I give him another shot. But I'm just not happy with the quality. You know, I rank them as my favorite place, so I'll probably give him another shot. 
Now, this burger for the price is probably something that the nurse, her hand would eat. It's for her hand. But let's go on to the next one. Yes, I have more. Let me put this here. This is Red Hot Ranch on Belmont and Lakeview. No, Belmont and Ashland in Lakeview. Now this I like because, you know, I might even like this better than the Hala Burger because it is a smash burger and I love smash burger. Now what a smash burger is, look at that. You see that? The beef gets smashed. I'm making a mess here, but the beef gets smashed. Let's clear some of this. There we go. And it leaves a nice crisp. Now this is a double burger. So, mmm, that is so good. This is an RHR Red Hot Ranch Burger. This is a regular cheeseburger and um, Red Hot Ranch Burger. But I, I'm using toilet paper because I ran out of paper towel. But look at this thing. I actually, yeah, this is better than the Hala Burger. You know, this is something that maybe uh, the Lord Commander Squire would eat right here. Mm. This is a double burger. Yeah, that's a good burger. For four bucks, four and a half bucks. Now let's try the, they give you fries too, but you know, soggy. That's just what happens when you take to go. Yeah. Yeah. All right, next up, let's try the triple burger. Now this is something the Lord Commander of the Night's Watch would eat. Not as quite as prestigious as the Wagyu A5 Miyazaki, but you look at this. <coughs> this is Triple. Now that is a heart attack right there. That is heart attack city right there. Mmm. Mm, mm. The cheese is like um, it's your classic American cheese, so it gets that melty texture. Melty texture. So this is like six bucks, seven bucks. Mmm. Now, triple cheeseburger is not listed on there, so I just asked for it. I think they go up as high as double. And one more we're gonna try. So, so far, this is my favorite. And then the double. Now, that Hala burger, I, you know, I'm disappointed in you. Let's go to the next one, which is, what do we got here? Oh, this is a single burger, okay, so. Yeah, this is probably very, very low. Somebody from Flea Bottom would eat. Look at this. But let's see how it fares with these other ones. Mm. I like the, the sauce they put on here. But let me show you um, what I mean by smash. Look at that. See? This is a smash and it gets crispy. Now, if you eat this right off the grill, it is really good and crispy, but they're still good. You know, that's the thing. So overall, that fucking Tempura burger, oh man. Jesus Christ. But second place, I like this triple, triple cheeseburger from Red Hot Ranch. Well, don't get it mixed up. There's other locations too, but I like this location. And I think you can get it late, late night too. Look at that. Look at that. The cheese and everything, you know. Now, of course, Temporis is the best. It is my favorite burger so far that I've eaten. I don't know that I could remember, but of course it is $25. Oh man, if you guys can only smell that, that's like smelling dirt. 
<laughs> well, earth, earthy. Mmm. Let's take a look at the beef. I mean, usually A5, you want to eat it. Look at that, look at how they cook it. You want to eat the meat by itself, not too much flavor. You want to taste. Man, that black thing's like squid ink. Is it maybe it's squid ink? I don't know. Yeah. I gotta look it up and then I'll put it in the description. But you also get something else. I got I got a couple things from Tempura, so let's check it out. Let's check it out anyway. So this is mushroom medley. No spoon. Huh. All right, so I gotta use my hand. Mushroom medley. What is this? Onions. Mmm. Wow. This is like seven bucks. Mushroom medley. Yeah, sorry. It's mushroom, but I mean, I didn't warm it up, so it's a it's a little bit like a little bit cold now. So I mean, you know, flavor wise, mushroom will cook good. For dessert, I got this. What is this? Some uh, what did what did I get here? What is this? Cheesecake. Huh. Oh wow, look at this cheesecake. It's like, it's very soft. Oh, let's see that, look how soft it is. Watch this. It just like disintegrates. You can't really, and you look at the bottom right there. It's like crumbs, Oreo cookies. Mm, that's what it is, Oreo cookies. Of course I don't have no fork. <laughs> I mean, but yeah. Mm. Wow, that is good. I mean, you know, you gotta need a fork, but you get the Oreo cookies, but it doesn't really taste a lot like Oreo that it would overwhelm, overwhelm it. Mm. So there you have it. Go, go try this, man. $25 burger. I mean, I guess it's a little bit more expensive than the Loyalist, but man, it is good. It is good. Mm. Before you even bite, you know already, you can feel the earthiness and smell it and taste it, the air of it, you know.